they have talked also um, about creating opportunities for the youth uh, in not only in the national government but also in the county government. Then we've, they also talked about um, the governance structure of our country, uh, particularly the structure of the devolution, the structure of the executive, and the structure of the legislature in our country. And they've said that uh, they're ready to present their views to the Building Bridges Initiative when the right time comes. They have also talked about corruption, and they share the views that we share, myself and the president, that corruption is a cancer that must be slayed, must, must be cured. It's a monster that needs to be slayed. And they have said that uh, it is eating at the fabrics of our society, denying job opportunities to the youth, impoverishing majority of our people, particularly the farming, community farmers, the pastoralists, the fishermen in our country. They are also concerned about insecurity in the country, generally. And they say that uh, this requires a, 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 a collective effort of all the people of our country. That uh, this corruption has seen the erosion of um, um, morals in our society, every, almost every sector of the society is affected, whether it is in the security sector, whether it is in the civil service, whether it is in the judiciary, whether it is in the re religious institutions, the churches, uh, the mosques. They are all affected in one way or the other, uh, and that this requires to be fixed including also the electoral institution in the country. So we have had a wonderful conversation with this with the youth, and uh, I'm going to ask their representatives to now take it from here and speak on their own behalf. Um, yeah. okay. Some of them, of course, are members of parliament. Okay. Uh, maybe you want to introduce okay. yeah. them, allow them to speak? Yeah. Yeah.